90 day, fiance's Annie Suwan wanted to bring her cousin Amber Boonmack to the U.S. on after the 90 days. The 18 year old is now engaged to an American M. Annie Suwan's cousin sister, Amber Radican Boonmack's engagement news could mean she's going to star in 90 day fiance next. Annie and David Taborowski were introduced to reality TV show viewers in 90 DF season 5. David had divorced his wife of 21 years, had suffered a stroke, and was dealing with financial difficulties when he met Annie in Thailand. He first saw her singing in a bar when he offered her a drink and proposed to Annie in a week or two. Despite Annie's family asking for a $15,000 dowry, David was able to take her to the U.S. Annie, and David got married in November 2017. Annie and David couldn't overcome their financial roadblocks for a while, but they soon started gaining popularity as pillow talk celebs. Fans started asking them when they would expand their family, but David already had three kids from a previous marriage and had a vasectomy done in the past. They decided they could adopt Annie's cousin sister and brother from Thailand and bring them back to America with them. Recently, Annie and David revealed they are looking into IVF as an option to have a baby of their own. Meanwhile, Annie's cousin Amber might not need her help anymore to fulfill her American dream. Annie and David's 90 Day Fiancé spin-off premiered Monday, January 10, at 9 o'clock p.m. It showed Annie and David working together to bring Annie's brother Jordan and cousin sister Amber to the United States. Time was running out as the kids had to get visas before the school year could start in the U.S. David and Annie struggled to respond to Jordan acting difficult because he didn't look too keen on moving. They avoided the choice to leave Jordan behind or risk Amber's last chance to relocate. Jordan was 14 years old, and Amber was 16 years old when they filmed David and Annie. After the 90 Days Season 1, Annie and David gave Amber and Jordan English lessons so they could visit the immigration department and ace their interviews. However, their visa applications were rejected twice on two seasons of the spin-off. I answered everything, and it was all going good. I thought I had gotten it. I did my best. Amber had said after returning from the governmental agency and breaking down in tears. By this time, Amber was 17 years old. She felt like she had disappointed Annie and David when her American visa was denied. Annie and I are very close, it's like we're sisters, Amber had told the cameras during her confessional. None of our family members have foreign partners, Amber had added. David was the first foreigner Amber had ever met. However, things have changed now for Amber since she is going to marry an American man herself. Annie shared several photos from Amber and Matt's engagement on her Instagram on 14 December 2023. Congratulations to my lovely and best, beautiful cousin Amber on her engagement day with Matthew, Annie wrote in her caption. 90 Day Fiancé cast members such as Jenny Slatton and Alina Johnson congratulated the newly engaged couple. According to his Facebook, Matt attended Southington High School in Connecticut and graduated from Central Connecticut State University in 2019. He was born on May 8, 1991, which makes him 13 or 14 years older than Amber, considering she's 18 years old in 2023. Matt has his own website called Eridos World. Annie and David haven't revealed how Matt and Amber met, but she seems to have first posted about him on Instagram in October 2023. Considering Amber is engaged to Matt now, the couple's next step would be to apply for a K-1 visa for Amber to come to America. The third time could be a charm for Amber, although it may not involve her getting adopted by the 90-day fiancé couple. Regardless, her engagement makes Amber a great candidate for the next season of 90-day fiancé because she's already a part of the franchise. Fans would love to watch Amber's dream come true as she heads towards a happy married life just like the one her sister Annie has with David.